For today's video, we are going to discuss how to find the derivative of logarithmic function. And there are two formulas that you need to remember. The first one, the derivative of ln u, that is u prime over u, and u prime, that is the derivative of u. And the second one is the derivative of log u to the base a, that is u prime over u multiplied by ln a. So those are the formulas that you need to remember in order for us to find the derivative of logarithmic function. So let's start and let's have an example. On the first set of example, we are going to find the derivative of logarithmic function. And we are going to use the formula, the derivative of ln u, that is u prime over u. So let us have number one. What is the derivative of ln x? So let us have the value of u, that is x, and u prime, that is the derivative of x, that is 1. So let us have u prime over u. So the derivative of ln x, that is 1 over x. And this will be our answer. On number 2, what is the derivative of ln x squared? So let us have u, that is x squared, and then u prime, that is the derivative of x squared, so we have 2x. And then let us have u prime over u, so we are going to have 2x over x squared. So we can cancel x and x squared, so we are going to have 2 over x. And this will be our answer. On number 3, let us have the derivative of ln 2x cubed. So let us have u, that is 2x cubed, and then u prime, that is the derivative of 2x cubed. So we are going to have 2 multiplied by 3, that is 6, and then x raised to 2. So let us have u prime over u. So let us have 6x squared over 2x cubed. So let us have 6 divided by 2, that is 3. And then let us have x, and then 2 minus 3. So we are going to have 3x raised to negative 1. So our final answer will be 3 over x. This will be our answer. On number 4, what is the derivative of ln x plus 5? So u here, that is x plus 5. And then u prime, that is the derivative of x plus 5. So the derivative of 5, that is 0. And the derivative of x, that is 1. So therefore, u prime over u, that is 1 over x plus 5. And this will be our answer. So let us have another set of example. On number 5, what is the derivative of ln x squared plus 5? So let us have the value of u, that is x squared plus 5, and then let us have u prime. So the derivative of 5 is 0, and the derivative of x squared, that is 2x. So therefore, we are going to have u prime over u, and that is 2x over x squared plus 5. And this will be our answer. On number 6, what is the derivative of ln 7x plus 5 minus x cubed? So let us have u, that is 7x plus 5 minus x cubed, and then u prime. So let us have the derivative of 7x, that is 7, and then the derivative of 5 is 0, and then derivative of negative x cubed is negative 3x squared. So let us have u prime over u, and that is 7 minus 3x squared over 7x plus 5 minus x cubed. And this will be our answer. What about a number 7? What is the derivative of ln sine x. So let us have u, 
and that is sine x and u prime that is the derivative of sine x so the derivative of sine x is cosine x so let us have u prime over u and that is cosine x over sine x so we can simplify this one because we all know that cosine over sine that is cotangent and then let us have x and this will be our answer on number eight what is the derivative of ln cosine x so this time the value of u is cosine x and then u prime that is the derivative of cosine so that we are going to have negative sine x so let us have u prime over u and that is negative sine x over cosine x sine over cosine and that is tangent so let us have negative tangent x because positive divide by or negative divide by positive is negative and this will be our answer on number nine what is the derivative of ln seventh root of x so the fastest way to answer this question is to write the given expression as the derivative of ln x raised to 1 over 7. And then, we are going to move 1 over 7 in front of the given expression. So let us have 1 over 7 multiplied by the derivative of ln x. So let us have 1 over 7. And we all know that the derivative of ln x, that is 1 over x. So our final answer will be 1 multiplied by 1, that is 1. And then 7 times x is 7x. This will be our answer. On number 10, what is the derivative of cube root of ln x? So to answer this one, let us write as d over dx ln x raised to 1 third. So basically, we have a chain rule. So we are going to move one third, and then one third, and then let us write ln x, and let us subtract one and one third. That is one minus three, that is negative two. Let us copy the denominator, that is three. And let us get the derivative of ln x, that is one over x. So let us simplify. One times one is one, and then three times x is three x. And to eliminate the negative sign on the exponent, since ln x is written in the numerator, so let us write this one on the denominator. So we are going to have ln x raised to positive 2 over 3. And to write our final answer, we are going to have 1 over 3x to the cube root of ln x square. And this will be our answer. On number 11, what is the derivative of log 2x to the base 3? So to answer this question, we are going to use the formula d over dx log u to the base a, and that is u prime over u ln a. So let us identify first the value of u. So the value of u, that is 2x, and then u prime that is the derivative of 2x and that is 2 and a that is 3 so let us have u prime over u ln a so let us substitute u prime that is 2 and then u that is 2x and then ln 3 so we can cancel 2 we are going to have 1 over x ln and this will be our final answer. On number 12, what is the derivative of log x square to the base 5? So let us have the value of u, that is x square, and then u prime, that is the derivative of x square, and that is 2x, and then a, that is 5. So let us have the formula 
u prime over u ln a. So let us have u prime that is 2x over u that is x square and then ln 5. So we can cancel x and x square and that is 2 over x ln 5. And this will be our answer. On number 13, what is the derivative of log 1 minus 2x to the base 7? So let us have the value of u. That is 1 minus 2x. And then u prime, that is the derivative of 1 minus 2x, and that is negative 2. And then the value of a, that is 7. So let us have u prime over u times ln a. So let us have the truth. So we are going to have negative 2 over 1 minus 2x ln 7. This will be our answer. On number 14, what is the derivative of log 3x minus x raised to the fourth base 2? So let us have u, that is 3x minus x raised to the fourth, and then u prime, let us have the derivative of 3x, and that is 3, and then derivative of negative x raised to the fourth, that is negative 4x cubed. And the value of a, that is 2. So let us have u prime over u ln a. So let us have 3 minus 4x cubed all over u, and that is 3x minus x raised to the fourth times ln 2. And this will be our answer. On number 15, what is the derivative of log tangent x to the base 5? So let us have the value of u, and that is tangent x. And then let us have u prime, that is the derivative of tangent x, and that is second square x. And then let us have a, that is 5. And let us use the formula, u prime over u ln a. So let us have u prime that is second square x over u that is tangent x and then ln 5. This will be our answer. On number 16, what is the derivative of ln ln x? So let us have u that is ln x and then u prime. That is the derivative of ln x, and that is 1 over x. So let us have the formula, u prime over u, and that is u prime is 1 over x, and then u is ln x. So this one is over 1, so let us multiply this one. 1 times 1, that is 1, and then x multiplied by ln x, that is x ln X, and this will be our answer. So I hope you will learn from this video. Thank you so much for watching and God bless us all.